this video, I will teach you how to type Japanese language. You don't need any special Japanese keyboard. You just need to go like quick setup on your laptop, then ta-da, you'll be able to type Japanese language. But as I use normal keyboard ABC, uh, there is a rule how to type Japanese by English. And especially if you have any knowledge of hiragana and katakana kanji like Japanese language, that would be very simple. But even if you don't have any knowledge about it, that's fine because boom, there is kind of chart or guide for typing Japanese and I'll link this below so you can look at it. Anyway, so let's jump into it. Remember to add Japanese language to your keyboard input if you haven't already. As you see, every hiragana ends with vowel sounds, such as a, i, u, e, o. So, add a consonant letter such as S, T, K, R, etc. to make the complete character. Ga gi gu ge go works the same way like this. When you want small letters, there are two ways to do. The most common way is type as it sounds, like this. The other way is type X or L before the letter you want make small. Also, small two can type like this as it sounds. This is easy, just type P on each sound. When you want katakana, just type it in hiragana first, then press the space key. That's it. Kanji works the same. You will see lots of kanji options by pressing space key. So maybe you notice, even though you don't know about Japanese language, maybe you can learn by typing Japanese, right? And also, if even if you don't know any about kanji, it, it doesn't really matter because the your laptop's gonna automatically change to katakana or kanji. So I think um, typing Japanese is one of the best way to learn how to write and read Japanese. So I hope you're gonna enjoy typing Japanese or learn something by that. So I have another video for how to type Japanese on your phone. So if you're interested, there's a link. So, and yeah. That's it. Thanks for watching and I hope you have a wonderful day. Thank you.